Hey guys, how you going? What I'm going to just show you right now is how to set up your uh, Google Webmaster tool. So once you've registered, you can just come straight into Google Webmaster. And the good thing about this is, you s when you do this, you actually one, you're submitting to the s to Google for your for your website to be on the search engine. Uh, two, you can also see where people are actually finding you on the internet as well like which keywords they're actually getting to your website with and this way you can see where you're ranked all the rankings, how they've actually found you all this sort of great stuff so what I'm actually going to show you right here is what you got to do is actually come and click on the add a site so what we're going to do you actually need to go and grab your domain name so we'll copy that so we come in here we'll put the domain name in once you've done that just click continue and you'll notice it says not verified all you need to do to do that is you see where the little asterisk is just in here you just need to highlight that just between the two asterisks for Yola and then just copy that and then go back to the Yola website and under the properties section there will be a section they call page what we want to do is we want to drop it in under where it says Google Webmaster Code so you just paste it in. It went, must remember when you paste in, also press the um, space bar because that will actually light up your save button so you can save it in. And once you've saved it, you also need to also update your website as well because when we go back to Google Webmaster, we're going to need to, um, or it needs to actually be able to see it. So now if we click verify, you'll notice that it will go green now, saying that it's verified and it's quite happy about the situation. See, now we're verified, Google's submitted us into a search engine now. Now there's one other little thing that we do need to do while you're in here. And this little link here, you need to set up your sitemap. So we just copy that. Because what we're going to do is where is it? We're looking for the site maps now. If you open up site configuration and go to site maps, it'll open up a page. And I have in here submit site map. So you just click on that. And you can see the web address which we've just submitted. You just need this little link and just drop it in here. Now, wh one of the r reasons you'd use a site map is because it, Google, it makes Google's job easier to, f to read your site for one. And the second reason is Google's also going to rank your site much higher in the search engines as well, which means that you can get a bit more traffic because of that. Now that we've done that, now everything's perfect in here. It will take a couple, of, probably a couple of days or maybe even a week before you see any activity in here. But when you come back later, you'll be able to see a lot of the crawlers activities and just check in on, see what um, search words people are actually using to get to your site and just all the stats really. But that's the re only main reasons that I suggest that you come in and do this because it's just a good thing to do. Now that's all you need to do just to do that. So that's pretty much the training right there on how to set up Google Webmaster Tool. Now I will speak to you guys on the next training. No catches then. Alright. Signing out.